hola, soy Eduardo de los Interrogantes. La historia de vuestros personajes está ambientada 70 años antes de los acontecimientos de Harry Potter. Si vuestros personajes viajas en el futuro, cosa que podría darse porque sois magos, ¿qué consejo daríais y en cuáles de sus entregas les ayudaríais? Ah, what the Harry Potter characters. Wow. I don't think they can get out of trouble. I think yeah. they have to go through it, right? I think that's the, the I, story. I, I would give them an, an education in magical creatures and explain how formidably useful <laughs> they can be in getting you out of uh, sticky situations. I would tell Harry that Sirius Black is a good guy. Yeah. <laughs> don't be scared of him. And therefore ruin the entire yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Completely different. Bueno, hace un par de semanas se hizo un pase especial con todas las películas de Harry Potter que duró casi 24 horas. ¿No os dan pena los fans? Si seguís haciendo películas, los vais a acabar matando. ¿Did you go? No, no. I, I'm sorry. I, 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 tenía que trabajar. I was working. Okay, right, right, right. I did feel yesterday because we went and surprised the fans towards the end of their 24-hour marathon. And I did want to go and give them each like individual hugs yeah. and hand them coffee just to be like <laughs> show and take my hat off in respect but I've never we've been around the world with this film and never have I seen fans as passionate that are willing to stay up for a whole 24 26 hours to yeah. to see these films so that was kind of formidable ¿Cuál es vuestro límite de ver películas seguidas? Oh Four, five, four, four. Do you know I don't think I've ever done I remember I was once doing a play in Liverpool and I was by myself in Liverpool, and then on my days off, I would just go and go from into the cinema, I'll play for once again, and, and then just, just like <laughs> go into all the films that I could. Um, not to be encouraged, by the way, I do not. <laughs> I'd hear first. I'd hear first. <laughs> when I was starting out, I would, I would, I would do like 15 films a week. Really? Yeah, I man. I was so determined to be an actor. Wow. But on my days off, I would just and read scripts like yeah. naked. Wow. <laughs> no! Just sit there, naked. The film really? naked. <laughs> the film naked. The Mike Lee film. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> La vida real, ¿os dais abrazo habit habitualmente o sois como los hermanos Scamander? No, no, we hug each other. We have this very, very odd thing that without ever having met each other, we grew up 100 meters from each other. So we both learned to swim in the same swimming pool. Mm. We used to go to the same old video store. We like went to the same the park. pubs, the park. So yeah. it's been like, it's, there was a very quick bond between. The memories are the marathon. same. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing. Que animal fantastico diríais que es el otro? I would say, I would actually say that Callum is a bit like the Thunderbird. In the first film, Frank the Thunderbird is very noble. I think of Callum as a very noble um, human. I'd say the zoo. Zoo. Yeah. Why? Because I can be a bit vicious, but kind of cuddly. You can, you can go a thousand miles a day. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> On caffeine. You're on caffeine. Um, brilliant, majestical, and, oh. but loving. I love this question. This is the great question. Because he's a hugger, see? He's a hugger. Yeah, I do like hugging. Yeah. ¿Quién es el mejor mago de los dos? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously. I mean, no question. Uh, yeah. Wait a second. He doesn't, like, he doesn't, he doesn't know. Look at him. Uh, he sort of. I just noticed it. it. He sort of barely has a wand. And actually, that's true. <laughs> On day one of filming, before we'd even started filming, he broke his wand. So he's just a bit of a shoddy. I just realised that I'm the only one not looking. Where am I looking on that poster, man? Yeah, you're just looking at. Your I'm just looking off. <laughs> Yeah. I'm angrily looking off. <laughs> no, has sido reconocido y galardonado por tu trabajo como actor en películas dramáticas. ¿Creéis que las películas de fantasía o ciencia ficción no reciben el reconocimiento que se merecen? Ah, oh, I mean, I often think for the people behind the camera when you see the amount quite often I think people go for big films they go oh they just throw money at it and it's like no 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 when you when you see the visual artists mm -hmm. and the amount of meticulous delicate work and often the artists who are animating the creatures are also basically actors as well because mm -hmm. they are literally bringing life and character to them so for me the great heroes are the visual effects artists the set designers the costume designers, they're exceptional people. I think you're right though. I think it also goes into the thing of um, Andy Serkis' argument about you know, mm. his performance with that new technology. Um, some of the performances Eddie's included in the, the Wizarding World are some of my favorite, like Gary Oldman, Sirius Black, Imelda Staunton. Mm. You know, these, these, are, these are incredible, impeccable performances that aren't recognized because they are in um, 
these mm. kind of films, but they're just as mm. brilliant. Totally, but the other thing that you have to do, which I was really bad at, was you have to, and I hope I'm, I, and I feel like I'm enjoying it more now, that is you just, you have to regress in your imagination to f being a kid again. You have to like lose censorship and just mm, like, mm. throw yourself into it and, and, and expand your imagination. And that's what JK Rowling's always done. It's just like, I think she's pushed all of our imaginations to, to kind of greater places. It's like that game, you know, when you're younger and you don't want to touch the floor because it's lava. Mm -hmm. And then you put the chairs out and you climb. It's like that times a million. Yeah. <laughs> Pues muchas gracias y enhorabuena por la película. Thank you so much. Thank you.